I just had a thought. These decoctions, after you make them, you'll be able to refill them with your alkahest, right? So there's no reason for me to not be using these. I'm just now realizing this. Hell yeah, man. <laughs> Ergot seeds. I've killed plenty of water hags, why haven't I gotten this? And this could be freaking useful. Though I have no idea what an echidna is. I mean, I know what an echidna is. But when you add that H to it, or replace the C with a K, rather. I'm not sure what it becomes. Um, so these are Andrego workers. I thought the workers were harmless. I thought wrong. <laughs> and then the colony, their duty lies in building nests and cocoons, acquiring food and caring for eggs and larvae. When threatened, they will summon warriors to aid them. Yet if forced to defend themselves, they will do so, and surprisingly well. It's hard to tell what they actually look like. And these guys. <laughs> Scared of these Andregas, are ya? Just wait till you see the warriors. Endless waves of Andrega workers are enough to overcome most attackers. When confronting more dangerous foes, Andrega colonies unleash their larger, stronger members, the so-called warriors. This caste lives only to fight, and gets ample opportunity to do so while defending the colony's borders or conquering new territory. And they have mace tails. I suppose. Well, what in the world is this? Before we delve into here, let's see what's on the outside. Every time I see one of those logs now, I wonder if there's something in it. What was the place called? Hindhold? Hmm. Hmm, there's not really anything on the outside, is there? bridge. Interesting. It's just like some castle keep. Huh. What do we get? Oh, what are are those harpies? Sure look like harpies. <laughs> uh. 
Oh, it's a nest. I am not gonna like how this goes. Harpies aren't really that bad, are they? All right. Harpies, harpies got their nest here. What? Oh, another one. <clears throat> that works not. There we go. different? A little bit. Oh, hey. Sword's gonna break. How about that? Harpies got their nest here. <laughs> they do. Really? Do you have to use a bomb on that? You couldn't just, like, scatter it with your feet? <laughs> Hello, hello, hello. 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 Not what I was going for. That's not flattering. So are there male and female harpies? Kits. This is at forty five per cent. Oh, hey, I forgot to look at this stuff. Okay, what does this look like? <laughs> They're so poofy. to sell. Alright. Let's use this. There we go. And that should hold it over for a while. Da 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 da. Ah, oh gosh. <laughs> Oh my goodness. There we go. Alright, uh... No. There we go. I have on here... Yes, this one is greater. Okay. So I now have... One lesser blue. One lesser blue, one greater blue. We have grave hag. Hmm. One greater green. One lesser green. One greater green. Is there like a super greater? What the? How long? How long has this been open? When did this unlock? Oh my gosh, I could have been using that this whole time. 
Necro Warrior, Wyvern, Wyvern, Necro Warrior, Necro Warrior, Lesser Red. Only one of them is actually Lesser Red. But dude! I could have had something here this whole time. That is upsetting. And this will unlock... Sorry. This will unlock next level. Which means... I'll be able to choose something new. <coughs> I really should probably start working on some of these. Just attack damage. Lightning reflexes. See, this would be really great if the crossbow actually did anything, you know? Disable monster special abilities, what? Battle trance. Hmm. When vitality reaches... What? When vitality reaches zero, adrenaline points will be consumed to restore vitality. Hello? Command restored is based on the number of adrenaline points. That is kind of actually really sweet. <laughs> Casting a sign, three adrenaline points will be consumed to upgrade the sign to the highest level and increase our intensity. Wow. Huh. Well, I'm thinking maybe we want... Maybe we should start doing sword damage next. Though I do really want fire stream. Uh, we've got choices to make, but leveling is a ways off. We'll worry about it later. Uh, of course. Oh, hello. Huh. Sticks letter. Hello. Hmm. I, the undersigned. George of Kagan, a witcher by trade, testify as follows. While traveling through Velen, I received a summons to provide professional testimony in the matter of the accused Bartoslav of Love Field. This Bartoslav stands accused of causing several shipwrecks near the lighthouse, which it is his duty to keep. Ships led astray by errant signals from his lighthouse have repeatedly smashed against rocks near the shore, and the lighthouse keeper is held responsible for this state of affairs. During the trial, Bartoslav testified that he was diligent in fulfillment of his duties and that the accounts were caused by night wraiths deceiving sailors with their false glow. Having investigated, investigated the area, I can testify that I found no trace of night wraith activity. There are likewise no signs of noon wraiths, mamoons, air nymphs, or any other specters in the habit of misleading warrior travelers journeying by foot, sea, or horse. I did, however, find the catastrophe's true cause. They were not the fault of the night rates blamed by the accused, but neither were they the fault of the lighthouse keeper himself. The accidents were caused by local hooligans who have taken to lighting fires on the hill at night and then robbing the ships that subsequently wreck upon the shore. I was put on their trail by Bartoslav's son who showed me the ashes from their misleading fires. 